In week two of 2013, the Detroit Lions came to visit the Arizona Cardinals. It was a great game, an epic game. Arizona won, but it was a mega matchup between Calvin Johnson and Patrick Peterson down at the bottom. Both were first team all pro players in 2013. Arizona had a plan. Right here, Calvin Johnson's running deep. And look at how deep the safety is over the top. We call that a cloud. They clouded Calvin Johnson on that play, made him check it down to Joyk Bell over the middle, which was incomplete. But Arizona, they knew that Detroit had a plan. They moved Calvin Johnson around all over the field. Here he is in the slot. Patrick Peterson is forcing him to go outside, taking the inside away with that safety over the top. And so Matt Stafford here goes to the one-on-one over the middle to his tight end, Brandon Pettigrew, and that got broken up. You couldn't keep Calvin Johnson down for very long. Here on this third and one early in the first quarter, Arizona went to a zero coverage, man to man across the board, no safety net. Calvin Johnson in the near slot. Patrick Peterson know that he's got him everywhere. And Calvin Johnson recognizes it and he cuts his route off quick. Stafford recognizes it and he just flips it to Calvin Johnson and all Patrick Peterson could do at that point is just tackle the catch. Lions with the first down. How about this? Calvin Johnson up at the top against Patrick Peterson. Here comes Arizona with the safety blitz. Patrick Peterson knows he's got no help here. Calvin Johnson stabs him outside, pushes off a little bit, I believe, but gets some separation, and Stafford put it right on a tee. Stafford and Johnson were playing some tee ball early in this game. Calvin Johnson on the first down. Patrick Peterson, he had some success too. Here he is against Calvin Johnson coming in short motion. They're going to run like a little flaker drive concept here, trying to bubble Patrick Peterson. He gets through it, and he picks up Carlos Dansby in the middle as a robber in the middle of the field, forcing an incomplete pass. You can take a look here at Carlos Dansby in the middle. I mean, he's just basically reading the eyes of Stafford. When Stafford looks to his right, looking for his favorite target, Calvin Johnson. Remember, Calvin Johnson was just coming off a season before where he had 122 catches for 1,964 yards. Yes, Calvin Johnson was the man, and he shows it on this play here. Here he's gonna run a quick slant. Patrick Peterson's got his hips opened up. He wants to force Johnson to the inside where there's a linebacker and a safety. The linebacker, Dansby, misses him, and it was a track beat. Calvin Johnson put his track shoes on, and Patrick Peterson chased him all the way to the goal line, but nobody was catching Calvin Johnson for the Lions' opening touchdown of the game. From the end zone, you can see Carlos Dansby is number 58. To your left, the linebacker off the ball. And Stafford is going to put it right on Calvin Johnson's back shoulder, away from Dansby. And I think when Dansby misses it, it kind of froze Patrick Peterson. Like he he thought the ball was going to be tipped or maybe even intercepted. And he just froze for a second. And that's all it took. That's all it took was just one little blink. And Calvin Johnson was 72 yards later in the end zone. And then there was this right here. How about Nate Burleson up at the top and Calvin Johnson? Man-to-man, zero coverage, no help. Arizona again blitzing Stafford. But watch what Nate Burleson does to Patrick Peterson. All he's going to do is just set that rub right there. No interference, no pit, just a rub. And that's all it takes to bubble Patrick Peterson. And Stafford gets it over the top to the outstretched arms of the six foot five Calvin Johnson for the second touchdown. Great job by Nate Burleson. But you can see that on this play here, This is a third and five in the fourth quarter. That's Patrick Peterson and Carlos Dansby inside against the stack route here of Pettigrew and Calvin Johnson. And they're gonna just basically run a little delay here. Pettigrew here, freeing up Calvin Johnson. And Dansby is gonna do a banjo call with Patrick Peterson. Right here, Peterson is telling Dansby, he goes inside, he's yours. He comes outside, he's mine. Banjo, they banjo perfectly on third and five and they not Detroit out right there, forcing a field goal attempt. Excellent job in communication with the Arizona Cardinals. Success, forcing the fourth down. Biggest play of the game, 25-21. Cardinals up, 127 to go in the game. Patrick Peterson and Calvin Johnson up at the top. They're going for it all. Stafford putting it on Calvin Johnson, and Peterson is in perfect position. He's playing the trail technique because he knows he's got safety over the top help. Incomplete pass. Here's the same play from the end zone. Stafford going for his favorite target. Just a a laser shot. Patrick Peterson is all over. He had Tony Jefferson, number 22, over the top to make sure he could afford to play that style. But look at the respect right here. 
between the two all pros, Peterson and Calvin Johnson. And finally, one last play here. Fourth and four. Stafford's got one more chance. He's got Calvin Johnson in the slot against Patrick Peterson. The respect right here, all game long for 60 minutes that Patrick Peterson showed Calvin Johnson, it dissuaded, made Matt Stafford go to Nate Burleson at the bottom here. No way did he want to challenge, look at that coverage by Patrick Peterson. He just threw the Patrick Peterson blanket all over Calvin Johnson, forcing the throw to Burleson. Tyron Matthew was there to make the tackle on fourth and four, Arizona made the tackle. Detroit couldn't get the first down. Patrick Peterson was celebrating. That was a mega matchup between two first team all pros, Patrick Peterson and Calvin Johnson in 2013 at University of Phoenix Stadium. What a day it was for both players and both teams.